All right. Well, the audio is going to be awful because there's no mic on here, but you'll get the gist. This is under the deck. <laughs> and there is Ethernet on top of the deck. And that's the coax going into the house. So we need Ethernet to come out of there now. Did you move so you weren't on camera? Yeah. You're still on camera. So I already buried it. The problem is we need to get it into the house. If you guys are uh, claustrophobic, that's about how much space we got. The microphone's not on the camera because I didn't really want to ruin the expensive microphone. And now you'll ask, but you're willing to ruin the expensive camera. It'll work, it'll make it. These things are tough, right? It's got a small rig on it. I don't fit under all of these, obviously. I do fit through that, and then I can go right, and then I can go backwards, and then hopefully I can go under the deck over there, so. I guess we're just gonna crawl along with me. All right, so I dug this out right here, so I can fit under here. Oh, I'm such a big fan of spiders that this really is my favorite part so far of all the construction. Oh yeah. Oh, they're beautiful spiders. Actually, I gotta dig this out first because I can't fit through that little cap right here. That's like hand height tall, so. Just a <laughs> Sean's gonna be pissed. Just a 5,000 ton camera sitting on the dirt. Making my way downtown, walking spiders. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Oh man, I just hate spiders so much. Every species of spider that exists. Get them. Get them. All right. It's on the deck. Cooper, this is the end. Right here. Cooper eating cat food. Hey, buddy. What's it doing? Well, hello. Uh, building update again. It's getting there. Now we need to take the pallets of and move into office. Dan doesn't think I can get all the pallets in there and I'm here to prove him wrong. So watch me move some pallets. What's your drink, which one you want? Oh, I brought more drinks. Oh, what do we got? I'll shotgun one of these bitches right now. I got uh, strawberry melon fizz. Have you and, had these? No. Joe did. And orange peach fizz. Literally best. I'll take that one. Okay, if you like fruity seltzers, best fruity seltzer I've ever had. Topos are better if you mm. don't want crazy flavor. Pretty good. Pretty good. I can't remember where I ended this last video. You guys haven't seen this wall paintbrush to know that. So, this is set, we'll call it set one. There's a rug in it. Yeah, I mean, listen, the stone didn't come in, so it's not done. My mom did that, because I can't do this. Ricky could probably. I think it's uh, people who are better that's stuff than I am. So we got the rug in that studio. Yeah, this one need to be fixed. AKA rug in, or carpet in this studio. <laughs> um, we're just using rugs because it's gonna be... Easier. So yeah. when Dan inevitably... Spills. It's like six bottles. True. We just get rid of it, buy a new one. Yep, a few hundred bucks. Wait, and you, the... You see this? I think people have seen this, but I think it was in the dark. Holy shit, you guys haven't seen that we have lights actually, now that I think about it. There's lights in most, in the rooms. And we'll have shelves up here for people. Yeah. These things, these pallets that have things on them that are undiscussed thus far. Um, the only reason they're going in the office is so that that floor out there can be painted like this floor. So, Sean said they'll all fit in here. That's one. How many are there? Seven, six? Yes. Oh, Let me out first. Nah. I'll live in there. That's more space than the whole fucking hut almost, it feels like. Uh, it's damn, square footage wise, it's damn close. Uh, look at that action. 
He's done. I'm just waiting for Sean to ram one of these into the wall. Right now. Freshly painted walls. Oh. oh. You got to settle down. Oh. oh. I can't see back there. I can't either. There's more paint in the world. There is. You know. Mom just took those to her house. Shout out to, to Mama Shook. Oh, she painted them? She took these to her house, painted all of them, and then drove them back. So now do you feel like a dickhead? Your mom knows I love her. Yeah, that's true. That'll make you less of a dick. It's time to open this bitch. I bought this like six months ago. Oh, wow. You're opening that? Yeah, because I mean, this is the first day we get to move stuff in here. That's a little premature. Nope. No, that's what they used to call me. Um... So, well, premature shit. the Dalmore Alexander, the freaking third, not the second or the fourth, because those guys were idiots. And you know what? Does Dalmore use coloring? Yup. Do I care? No. So, literally long poured it, nailed it too. I'm trying to figure out how I Jenga this in there. Cheers, sir. Oh, it's bright as hell now because I moved. This is the worst part about people who walk around and film things. Yeah, she. This smells like. It's okay. How much you pay for this? What? Sewer free. It, it's free oh, as long as you don't like hundred dollar bills. Do we have to shoot a Friday? Yeah, we do. Yep. Now I know exactly what proof that Friday is because it's hanging out at the end of the third. You're still getting your teeth slapped. <sighs> Mark my words, I win this month. Nope. Oh, God. How's that going? Well, I, I can get my little bit extra room if I go uh -huh. in and out. This is great, this tripod, because I can just hold this up. People can watch you absolutely botch this. I'm so fucking nervous. This is a great angle. I'm kind of like a drone. Like a human drone. Nope. Not, we didn't get it there. So we'll get it a little closer, though. If this camera falls, it's gonna break, and I'd like to apologize ahead of time because it is literally nine feet in the air. <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh, how tight is it? I should check that. Very. It's pretty tight. No, about as tight as I am right now. Think too wise. Let me know. And Sean said they all fit in here. Woo! Right so far. Legally. Wow. Touche. What extra? This is the entryway. <laughs> That's the room that he said they'd fit in. That's the noise you're hearing. Well, so, um, the mini splits are in. Ricky poured three poor guesses for us. So when Sean gets here later, we can shoot those for August. We gotta batch that stuff because we're gonna. There's gonna be a portion of life here now where we have actually have shot all of the content that you guys are watching right now um, in July, and we did that because the meetups in August. Um, I have a week in August where I'm gone. Sean has a week where he's gone. Both before the meetup, week of the meetup is just gonna be meetup stuff most likely. Um, yeah, and then the meetup's the 20th. You guys will be seeing, realistically, you guys are watching this at the end of August, and then September, we're gonna start shooting in here. So, in my real time, uh, we're about a month away from shooting in here, and your real time, the next video that you watch will probably be shot in here, which will be really cool. It's an old little tinker top. There he is. Oh, it's an old, it's an old Cooper. All right, cut the live real out. What is that? This was inside the box. What is that? It looks like a cat. It looks like a turd, but it's not. Caterpillar, like, dude, that's gotta be a cocoon, right? Little dad move. So, the next step is, oh my gosh, it's overexposed literally just because you're on camera. The next step, step, stop, is that uh, before he puts insulation in the ceiling, up here, they're gonna blow insulation up there. And before they do that, uh, the ventilation for the cigar stuff needs to go in, which is up there, right? 
Yes. This giant fan. Yeah, the fan's up there right now. This is all the ducting that has to go on it. Minus the two couplers that are drying. Look at that freaking... Do pick... Yeah, that's a 12 inch. <laughs> it's literally bigger around than Sean is, which is so hilarious. So we got two 10 inch lines coming in, going to the 12 inch fan. It looks like a cartoon object. Like yeah. it's so ridiculously sized. Yeah, we shouldn't have to worry about airflow though. My gosh. So the fan was actually sent to us by AC Infinity. The cloud line. It's a 12 inch cloud line. Look at this. There she is. This giant monster uh, is, is it double? No. Do we have a six inch in the hut? Yes. And this is a 12. So you now know how circles work, so that's exponentially bigger. So as I've been telling Sean for years, this is exponentially larger. <laughs> it's like a pizza, you know? I feel like this just needs to go on there. Oh my! <laughs> Probably should taste it and figure out if it's still good. Mm -hmm. ah, it's so nice. Okay, somebody call OSHA. This man's holding wood and drilling it with the other hand. Just a super unsafe practice. No, that's fine. We don't have to follow OSHA if we don't want to, right? That's the rules? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I can see. It's like daytime over there, but in reality... Getting over here was not easy if you were <laughs> Hold on. All these fucking stringers make it impossible. I don't, they're only on this side too. What? These stringers, these crossbars. Oh. They're not on the other fucking side. That's interesting. So it's so easy to get over there, but I can barely get. I wonder why they're not on that. And I'm a little guy. That's so terrifying. Let's try to do this without going through. They almost got me falling through on video. Literally perfect. And you can kind of see Sean hidden in the fucking darkness. <laughs> Natural habitat. Natural. Are you scared you're a big dog? Hi, right, Cooper. Hi, right, buddy. Oh, it's a dog. Don't want me, dog. All right. Sean got most of the ventilation stuff done, but that camera's crooked as hell. I figure that you guys probably give more of a shit about Cookie's new castle, or as much of a shit, as our new castle. So tall. <laughs> Cookie's gonna be ecstatic. He's gonna love that. Throw a little catnip in there for him. He's gonna be all over that. We're doing that tonight, 100%. It is a new day. Again, so many new days. My mom came and painted the floor, like the main area floor. Sean is going to finish the ventilation. He had to order some more um, ducting, I think people would consider that. Uh, we gotta make all the shelves, obviously, for this wall. We're gonna have them all on a switch. Both of them are gonna have dimmers. This is the, that, you know, light. But then there's gonna be an LED, like a switch for the LED lights here with the dimmer on it as well. So we'll be able to dim all of those and control them all from one switch, which will be freaking amazing. So we need 20, 38 of these. I didn't really think that 38 would be a lot. Come to find out, 38 is a shit ton. So I went to get more, because I had one. Hobby Lobby said out of stock, and this whole wall is designed around these shelves or these uh, brackets. The Hobby Lobby near us had three. I had one, so that makes four. I went online, said out of stock. When I refreshed it, it said that there were in stock. So I put in 34, because that's how many we need, and it gave me six. And I bought six, and then it said out of stock again. And then three days later, 
bought I, the same thing happened. I bought six more and then said out of stock again. So I'm assuming that every once in a while they just put six up on their website and so I'm just gonna buy them when they come up. Mark is like the best contractor ever. Um, he did a bunch of work in our house for us. He does, has done a bunch of work on my parents' house and, and he's obviously done this job. Um, he's the best. Just wrote Mark a check, there she is. That was the second check. So that is uh, paid in full. Thanks to you guys and all your support. The, the end all be all, we, I think like, it was really close to $60,000 raised. Like that's, <laughs> that's like a phenomenal and extravagant amount of money. Um, what it removed stress wise from this project for us, because we're working on this other really big project that we haven't announced publicly that some of you know about it, you're, that some patrons know about it and stuff. This building project, that was the second one. The first one was a pretty close to the same amount. Electrician, electrician with that back wall, all of it said and done somewhere around 11, 12 grand. Heating cooling was somewhere around seven, eight grand, something like that um, for the whole building. So we're, we're at like 58, 59,000 with this all said and done is real, roughly how much it's gonna cost before we furnish. Um, you guys took the, the building, the weight of this project, this building project, you guys took that off of us. Um, <laughs> No way that I'm gonna cry this long after the fundraiser. Mm. You guys took that off of our shoulders. Um, and it's, I don't know how to thank you guys. Neither of us will ever be able to. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for coming on this journey. Thank you for being a part of this. And thank you for making the Junkies family different. And just, it's just different, man. It is not the same as everybody else's. And I can't tell you guys how much that means. Stick around because what we are going to announce very soon here uh, is the next big chapter, I would say, of our lives, honestly. So, um, it's the next big thing that I hope will outlast and outgrow and, 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 and out, you know, whatever, uh, bourbon junkies. I really do hope that. And I want, I think you guys will be excited to come on that adventure as well. So, can't wait to share that with you guys. But yeah, I love you guys so much. I appreciate the hell out of you guys so much. So we gotta make some Patreon. Well, not Patreon. Uh, I'm gonna make shelves. I'm gonna make shelves. Figure this fucking thing. All right, get power. Get it there. How does it unlock? Must be smarter. So I built a little router jig and uh, drop the blocks in there, take off the top, shape them, ready to go. We don't have enough uh, six by four right now. I'm five shelves short, but I can get these routed and sanded and ready to go while I wait for more lumber. So, safety glasses. Apparently that uh, breaker blew. Good. We got the pile. So now we got our pile. We gotta take all these and sand them all down. So oh, that's not turning. Well, in true Michigan fashion, it's now pouring rain. Of course, it's raining this way into the garage. I really hope the uh, the camera. We'll pick up the fact that it is sunshine, but also raining out right now. <clears throat> I'm assuming it's gonna start snowing here shortly. Welcome to Michigan. All right, been working uh, 
for a while, had some dinner. We got a couple shelves left, but uh, this motion light just came on in front of me and I don't see anything. So I think I'm about to die. So we had a good run. All right, building update. We have lights. Uh, they're bright as hell right now. There's not a dimmer installed, but uh, I was gonna go get some more board today, but I have to cut at the parking lot because Lowe's won't cut a six by four. Uh, just because they won't, so I have to cut it in the parking lot, but it won't stop raining. So I don't want to stand out in the rain and do that. I'm gonna just wait. But I'm gonna work on the shelves that we have. I gotta toast them up with the torch, do some staining, see where we get today. And that's what we'll have, that's what they'll look like before stain. Right, I gotta do that like 50 more times. All right, we got the, the first round of 30 whatever shells. I need to make up a couple extra in case I'm split while we're drilling. This round is torch, and we're staying. Update, little office update because we haven't gone over this because I just did this this weekend. But office, it's, it's already, desk is already messy because I've been in here for four, a few days working. But, Cookie Cat, this is Cookie's Castle. This will be basically like Sean's desk. I got a monitor I'm gonna throw on here and then if Sean needs to edit or something, he can just plug his laptop in over here. We'll move like the whiskey, or yeah, all the whiskey and stuff. Right, this breaking coffee, well. The ca <laughs> castle brought to you by Black and White Coffee Roasters. The one and only coffee of the castle. And if you guys wanna name a plant, there's an office plant. This weekend, we're doing a little move where we uh, have a bunch of people over, a few people, I think it's gonna be like six people, seven people, something like that. But we're going to move so much stuff from there into here. So that will probably be the next thing that you guys see. What lens do you want to try to turn? That shit. The Entertain Sean. All right, look at everybody's here. So, okay, the client is out of retirement. Then, for today, today, for the day, it's Sean's birthday in real time. Yeah, in real time. Not like when this video comes out, but in real time, it's Sean's birthday. So, Klein, Luke, Chris, Brandon, Sean, me, and then a guy named Andy is coming, and we're gonna move everything, ish, from over there into here. And Sean's working on the tripod setup so we can hyperlapse everything, but. That's what you're gonna see today. So, see you guys in a minute. Right. When the Lord has made it. Oh, I didn't break. Oh. <laughs> John dropped the first bottle. Yeah, whoever's in there, <clears throat> Klein. Super slow, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you want that one in there or this one? Uh, Doesn't matter. Both. One on one. Oh, no uh, way, I can't believe this. How you guys doing? Well, 
the hut is pretty freaking empty. Very, very empty, and you're still stepping on shit. There's no tables. I don't even know why that bag's down there. Thankfully, a handful of people came over and helped us move today. And now, gym stuff will go in here and sets will be organized. And now the castle's full of things. Shelves, bottles. All of, almost all of our whiskey. Yeah. A little bit in here. I mean, I'll snort it. A hundred and something. Lights, and then, yeah, those are all store picks. And then Luke made this ridiculously good food and brought it for everybody, which is super cool. That pulled pork, oh my gosh, dude. I think, he, were those pork butts? Yeah. Oh, but yeah, so basically what we're gonna do is these are our back walls. So these are the walls that you guys are not gonna see. This is, these are the walls we're gonna be looking at while we're shooting. We're going to, put like really long two by eight by 12s or something like that across here. And then we can stagger bottles and that's gonna help a lot with audio and echo to absorb some of the noise that's bouncing around in there. Um, and those won't take, actually those won't take long to hang up at all. So, um, but when Ricky's got the Tahoe back, I, we can go pick those up and then look at that. There are shelves with whiskey on them. Now in theory, we should just leave this in like time lapses so when these fall, you guys get to see it all. But. Oh, it's so loud and so expensive. It's so loud and wet. We're at the point in the project and in the video where there's just so many things that were done and so much content that was shot. We just can't fit it all in. This video is already really long. And so I'm just going to fast forward and hyperlapse all of the stuff that we did, shelves and making the set, everything, just to try to get you guys caught up to our real. Time. The last couple weeks since the meetup, we've been doing nothing but trying to get a set up and running, trying to make things feel more comfortable in here and more normalized so that we can get back to thinking about the content we're making more so than just shooting content to make sure we have something available. It's been mentioned a few times in these videos, especially in this one, that we're going to be announcing something really big for us very soon. And a lot of content in the future will be able to be made around that too which will be awesome thank you guys so much for coming on this journey with us thank you for being a part of this ride hope that you guys had a freaking great time watching the castle will be an evolving thing for a little while here all of the sets still aren't done but you guys are caught up to our current day so realistically there will be another episode of building updates you guys just won't be starting from so far behind this time Thank you guys for the support. Thank you for the love. We appreciate the hell out of you guys.